This aircraft has got a bit long in the tooth. A long-serving Airbus. On its wings, it's carried many people through the air. Now it appears in front of the tall gate. It's promised that an Airbus which is allowed to go through this gate has earned a second life. Here it is reborn as a modern and efficient freighter aircraft. At the beginning, it is painful. The aircraft's interior is ripped out. Even the heart of the aircraft, the sensitive avionics, has to come out. What remains is bare skin. Now it's time to be born again. And in this way, the Airbus is converted into a freighter aircraft. The windows are plugged, a cargo loading door is installed, an enormous opening in the fuselage. Two strong frame shells provide stability. One of them is installed above the door, the other one below. Inside the aircraft, the old frames are replaced with stronger segments, and new strong cross beams are put in. The conversion of the interior is then prepared. The cargo loading system is installed. The cockpit is modified and refurbished. Behind it, a courier area is installed. However, without pain, it's still not ready for departure. The upper frame shell is opened because it has to be strengthened for the future cargo door. Precision work done by hand to within a millimeter. The upper frame shell is 30 square meters large, which is now taken off. The gaping wound in the outer part of the aircraft is closed by a stable shell. Hundreds of rivets are meticulously put in by the workers. Quality is of the utmost importance and it's continually checked. In the fuselage of the Airbus, it's likewise all about stability for the future freight. The old frames are replaced with new, stronger segments. Stronger cross beams, on which the weight will rest, are installed where the old ones were. And here, like everywhere else, made to measure. The new cargo door arrives. 630 kilos. It's like a puzzle to get this enormous part into the correct position. It fits. Now the fuselage of the freighter aircraft is complete. It's more stable than it has ever been. Now it's time to convert the interior. The cargo loading system is important. The container should be able to be easily maneuvered onto it. It also offers the load steady support. Finally, it's finished. Where passengers once sat, there's now room for 50 tons of freight.
Now it can begin the second life as a freighter aircraft. An Airbus A300 reborn in the Elbe Flugzeugwerke. Rising like a phoenix.